There once was an anglerfish who lived deep in the darkest part of the ocean. The anglerfish had a little light on his head so that he could see where he was going and to find food. It worked okay for a while. The fishes around him were drawn to the light, and the anglerfish would eat them up as they came close. The anglerfish felt bad about eating the little fish, but there was nothing else around except fish so big that they would eat the anglerfish if he went near them. But eventually the little fish got wise to the anglerfish and didn't come near him anymore. You won't fool us anymore, anglerfish, said one of the little fish. So the days went on, and the anglerfish grew hungrier and hungrier, and the ocean grew colder and colder. The anglerfish wandered aimlessly for months, not knowing what to do. Sometimes he swam in little circles. Sometimes he just floated in one place. Then one day the anglerfish saw a something in the distance, and he raced towards it. As he came closer, he saw it was food, delicious-looking food that he had never seen before. It was like a gift from God. The anglerfish bit down hard on the food and savored its taste. It had been so long. Suddenly, the anglerfish felt pulled upwards. What could this be, he thought. He saw a great bright light, more beautiful than anything the little anglerfish had ever seen. And as he got closer, he saw a strange figure like he had never seen. Is that God? thought the anglerfish. The strange figure ear held the anglerfish in his hand for a moment. It was then that the anglerfish noticed a large spike going through his lip. The strange figure pulled out the spike, and the pain the anglerfish felt was gone right away. This must be God, thought the anglerfish. He was so happy. God carried the anglerfish over to a small box and put the anglerfish inside. It was very cold and very dark in the box, so the anglerfish turned his light on. He saw only ice and the sides of the box. Well, God must be coming back for me soon. I'll, I'll just wait here. And so he waited. And waited. And waited. And the anglerfish's lights began to dim, and his skin began to freeze, and his muscles grew stiff. Everything grew dark. Later that day, the box was pulled out again, and out from the box the anglerfish was pulled out, frozen stiff. It was God again! He finally came back! He's going to save me, thought the anglerfish. God set the anglerfish down on a table and grabbed a big, shiny knife. Finally, everything is going to be all right, thought the anglerfish. And then the anglerfish, frozen to his very bones, is hacked to pieces. The End <laughs>